Hi, if you are struggling with dry skin, this is the video for you. I'm Carrie Benjamin. I'm the esthetician and founder of Stack Skin Care. Today, I want to talk to you about the causes of dry skin, how to treat it at home, and go through a morning and evening skincare routine. So let's get started. Okay, the first thing I want to talk to you about is dry versus dehydrated skin. Dry skin is lacking oil and dehydrated skin is lacking water. So you can have both dry skin and dehydrated skin and treat them differently. Dehydrated skin, you need to increase your water intake. You can obviously do that through drinking more water. Um, you can also eat foods rich in water like watermelon and celery. Um, a easy way for you to tell if your skin is dehydrated is you can do the pinch test. So if you pinch your skin and it doesn't bounce right back, you're likely dehydrated and you really need to increase your water intake. Now, dry skin is lacking oil. It is a skin type or condition and you need to treat that topically. So a lot of people don't realize that dry skin is, um, can be treated uh, with exfoliation. So a lot of times what's happening is the dead skin is sitting on top and it's not allowing products to penetrate. And so you can keep putting moisturizers and oils on top of your dead skin, but it's just not gonna help. So the first thing that we need to address is make sure that you're doing a proper exfoliation routine. That's gonna be the foundation of helping uh, res uh, resolve the dryness. And then we wanna make sure that we're using the proper topicals to moisturize the skin and then seal and protect it. So let's talk first about exfoliation techniques and how we can start with your basic skincare routine. Okay, so before we dive into an AM and PM skincare routine, I just wanna to touch a little bit about exfoliation and the types of exfoliation that I like to do. So there's three types of exfoliations that are in our product line. We have dermaplaning, which can be done once a week. We have our multi-acid TCA peel, which can be done several times a week. It's a gentle, no downtime peel. And we also have an enzyme mask that will also gently exfoliate the skin and also rehydrate it with a lot of um, humectants that we formulated this product with. So any good skincare routine, you're gonna first cleanse. Um, when you have dry skin, I always recommend using a really gentle cleanser. It's gonna be pH balanced. You don't want anything stripping the oils. We have a really nice prebiotic gel cleanser. This is gonna feed the good bacteria. It's gonna, it won't strip your skin and it's very gentle. So I recommend, you know, in the morning you're gonna cleanse your skin and then you wanna make sure that you're properly moisturizing it. So the first step after cleansing is going to be to hydrate your skin. So we've got our hyaluronic acid hydrating serum in our product line. Now you can use this, you can use a glycerin, but I definitely recommend a humectant serum to help pull moisture into the skin. And then you wanna make sure that you're also adding in a moisturizer. And in our product line, we have this microbiome daily moisturizer. Not only does this have ceramides that are gonna really help to moisturize the skin, but it also has um, a really potent antioxidant in it called astaxanthin that is gonna help protect the skin, not only from UV and environmental um, irritants, but also from the blue light from your phones and your other devices. And then after that, you wanna apply an SPF to protect your skin during the day, additionally on top of your antioxidant. And then I like to seal and protect my skin with the face oil. This, this face oil in our product line is a fermented face oil. It is going to absorb quickly without feeling greasy. You can wear it both morning and evening. I, in fact, like to mix it with my tinted moisturizer um, during the day to give me a nice natural glow, and then I'll use it in the evening as well. So you wanna cleanse, use a good humectant serum to help draw moisture into the skin, um, a moisturizer with ceramides that are gonna help you know, really drive more moisture in, and then you wanna use an oil that's going to seal and protect the skin to prevent water loss, which is called TUL or trans epidermal water loss. So really basic skincare routine in the morning. And then for the evening, I wanna to talk to you how you're gonna to start to incorporate exfoliation. So by removing that dead layer of skin, you're really gonna be able to maximize the um, potency of your hydrating ingredients um, and products that we just talked about. So for a good evening skincare routine, you're gonna to start to incorporate exfoliation. Now there's I, as I mentioned, several different ways that you can exfoliate your skin, and the ones that we have in our product line are dermaplaning, peels, and an enzyme mask. Um, so in the evening, always wanna start with cleansing, and once a week, if you want to use dermaplaning, this is a single-edged sharp blade, 
Uh, we have YouTube videos on how to use. We're gonna link all of this below. This is a great way to exfoliate your skin. It's gonna instantly remove that dead skin and peach fuzz. And just by removing the dead skin, you're gonna instantly feel less dry. And then your products, you're gonna feel them just absorb right into your skin. So I highly recommend using dermal cleaning. Um, I like to do it once a week. Um, but it's a personal choice and if you want to use it less frequently, you can. If you're doing things like peels and retin-A's and retinols um, and speeding up your cell turnover, you might find dermal cleaning weekly beneficial for you or you might want to do it every other week. But it's instant relief if you're feeling dry. We also have in our product line, as I mentioned, our TCA multi-acid face peel. I love this peel for dry skin and in fact developed it um, with this in mind. It's a really gentle, no downtime peel. You don't even need to remove it. It actually self neutralizes. So you just put it on and leave it on. And it's gonna help speed up your cell turnover. It's gonna help with the dryness. It's gonna help brighten your skin. It's gonna help dislodge your pores. And you just literally apply it, leave it on overnight, and you're gonna rinse as, um, as usual the next morning. And then we also have a really nice enzyme clay mask. And this is gonna really, you know, gently break down the dead skin and um, rehydrate it with uh, the hydrating properties that we have in the clay mask. So the way that you would incorporate this into your skincare routine is a typical facial. You're gonna cleanse first, and in the evening you'll exfoliate. So if you're gonna dermaplane, first you would dermaplane, and then you could either apply the peel, or you can even apply the clay mask. The evenings that you're not dermaplaning, I recommend using this peel a few times a week, Maybe start out two to three times a week and see how that goes for you. You could easily increase it to four to five. And on the nights that you're not using this, maybe you do an enzyme mask that's a little more gentle. Um, and it's also, like I said, gonna rehydrate the skin. So again, you wanna cleanse your skin and then you can exfoliate it. There's a couple different forms of exfoliation and you could certainly do one or two of them on any given evening. And then after you exfoliate, you wanna treat your skin. So that's when you're gonna to start to include your hydrating serums, your humectants, like our hyaluronic acid serum that I mentioned earlier. Also, you wanna put your moisturizer on. It's gonna have the ceramides that are gonna help uh, with more hydration. And then finally, you're gonna end with a, um, a face oil that's gonna seal and protect the skin and to prevent the water loss. So really, the routine is pretty much the same as in the morning, except in the evening, you're gonna be adding some exfoliation. If you're super dry, starting to add this exfoliation in is gonna instantly alleviate this dryness and it's gonna allow your products to work a lot better. So whether it's dermaplaning, peels, or enzyme masks, um, you know, all of these are gonna help to alleviate that dryness and allow your products to work a lot better. We're gonna stick a bunch of links um, down below for you to reference, and I hope this was super helpful. If you have any questions, you can reach out to us at hello at Stack Skincare. You can set up a free virtual consultation, and you can also DM us. Thanks so much for watching.